Hey there, what is up internet? My name is Black Light Attack and welcome to episode 10 of Super Grabio Boobies. Uh, last time, what did we do last time? I guess we got started on Noki Bay, right? My dog's looking at me, she's like, why are you talking to yourself? Usually my dog doesn't hang out in my room, but it's a little bit weird situation going on right now. Everybody's out of the house. I live at home and normally she sleeps in my parents' room, but they're gone and she thinks they're dead, so. Um... <laughs> And also, normally her job is to uh, stand at the top of the of the stairs. She she sleeps at the top of the stairs and patrols because you can see my front door from the top of my stairs. So since that's the only entrance upstairs, she like thinks it's her job to guard for burglars and murderers. So she just sits up there. But I put a baby gate up there because she can't really walk and she has a hard time standing up. So um, I kind of fear that one day she's gonna try to get up from her foot at the, or her, uh, her seat at the top of the stairs and fall. So, I put a baby gate up and, uh, she's not too happy, so she's just guarding me instead. <laughs> but, hopefully I shouldn't be disturbing her too much. She's sleeping. Kind of on and off, but hopefully I, sh I should not be disturbing her too much because she's, like, deaf. So, so uh, yeah, we're gonna do the, um, 100, uh, yellow coins, and I'll probably look up online where the secret star is in this level, because I can't remember. I got it not too long ago. I replayed this game before I let's played it, and uh, I decided to 100% it, but I cannot remember where all the stuff is. Wait, there was just... hold on. Oh, I might have just found it. And that's probably a blue coin. Come on, baby. No, blue coin. Oh, you awake? Oh, sorry, Joe. Yeah, I woke her up. Come on, Chili can't hear anything except for when I need her to, to not hear things. Yeah, okay, so no. Oh my god, look at these collaterals. So yeah, we'll get the coins, and then we'll do... I guess we'll do some more Noki Bay. And then I can do... I'll do episode 10.5 will probably be the blue coins of... Uh, what's this called? I forget. Gelato Beach? Yeah, Gelato Beach. Did I get all these? Okay, yeah. I think it did. Ooh, you know what? I don't have the rocket nozzle yet. I don't know if I need that. I might. Ooh, I don't know. Should probably check that before I keep doing these. One more. Ah! Motherfucker. Okay, um... I think I know where it is in this level. I'm gonna be really pissed if I have to, like, find... Ooh! Yeah, it looks like I can get it. Okay, good. That doesn't look great out to anybody, does it? I could be imagining things. Hold on. Ah, God! Trees all of a sudden. Suddenly fucking trees. Okay, good shit. Good shit. Dum 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 dum. Mario. Shut up, Flood. I don't care. I don't care about what you have to say. Okay. In some levels, you can like, you can spray the tops of the trees like in Bianca Hills, but no. Hold on, come on. There we go, okay. Don't want the blue coin. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah! Oh my god, so slick. Too slick. Ooh, you know what? It might have something to do with Yoshi. I forget how you get the Yoshi egg. Maybe. Oh shit! I just remembered! I just remembered something, you guys. You have no idea how exciting this is for me. I don't often remember things. This is great. Every day is like a brand new day to me. Even if I do the same thing every day, it's still an adventure because I have the worst memory of all time. Boing. I remember. I'm not gonna get it right now, though, because it'll end the level and it'll undo all the progress I've made stomping coins out of duck asses. Now, I really hope by the time I'm done this that I don't forget where it is, because <laughs> I will be very upset. I remember where the secret star is. Okay. You fucker. Now, that coin better not despawn. Better not- Oh, fuck. I hope I don't need that. I'm gonna fucking stomp your ass, boy. That's what you get. Oh, God. Bees. I'm gonna kill them. Because... Now, usually those bees are how you get a blue coin. Whenever you see a beehive, 
there's probably a Yoshi in the level. I think every time you see Beehive, there's also a Yoshi in the level. I just gotta run until the crowd disperses. Because they're gonna be pissed I knocked down their hive. But whenever you see, see a Beehive, there's also a Yoshi somewhere in the level. And Yoshi can eat them for blue coins. Okay, I think I got both of these. You. And the reason I wanted them dead is because they can actually come. Oh, no, they're here and they're still pissed. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry I destroyed your home. I did not mean it. It was all Yoshi's fault. No, not the blue. Not the blue. Okay, how am I going to get this? How am I going to get this without getting the blue coin? I'm not. Okay. Like someone said, it wouldn't be... It wouldn't be a episode of Mario Sunshine if I didn't accidentally get a blue coin. Somebody said that in the comments section. It seemed very accurate. Fuck off, bees! Okay. I think I really did myself in. Now, you see that that blue quack thingy? I forget what they're called. Quack and dig. Fuck off. Okay. There we go. That's enough of that. Had enough of these goddamn bees. That one blue... I don't know if you caught it, but there's a blue one of these things. Uh, sleeping in the tree. That one... Is... He gives you a blue coin. Alright, you know, I'm gonna speed this up because this is just gonna be me like breaking watermelons over and over, so BRB.
contemplating suicide, I remembered a place where there are uh, a couple more coins. So that's good. Yay! So let's head over here. And can I get up here? I can. Alright. Here's some coins. You probably saw the coins down by the swingy slide thingy. Some of these. A couple blue coins over here as well. There we go. Up to 91. One over there. Oh shit! <laughs> that was goofy. Let's forget that ever happened. No blue coins? Okay, no blue coins. Alright, so we should only need to grab a couple from the, like, the ones in the sky. Oh no, never mind. We'll actually finish right now. Sweet. Because those ones, those ones up there are pretty difficult to get, actually. It's hard to aim, and then if you fuck up, then you gotta go back down and do it all over again, and it's just a pain in the ass. So I am pretty glad that I don't have to deal with that. Because now I'm going over to a slide, or a swing, rather. Went over to the swing, aim this shit, and boom, baby. There you go. And then we'll get the uh, secret. Actually, I'm probably like a lot quieter than I was a second ago. Let me move my chair up close to the mic. Okay. What the fuck? Sometimes he goes, sometimes he doesn't. Mario's just testy right now. Fuck you, Mario. I don't need you to judge me. Okay, that's number 51. I'm trying to be a bit more quiet because I feel bad if I wake up my dog, but I don't know. Like I said, she's deaf. Chasing them bunny rabbits. Dreaming doggy dreams. I guess it's all dogs must dream about is chasing things. What else could a dog possibly want, to be honest? Chasing things, pooping on things, eating things. Although I never see my dog sleep eating. I would think I would see that a lot more. You'd think dogs would always be dreaming of like, you know, the treats we keep for for like a reward whenever she does something good up in the cabinet. You'd think she'd be dreaming of those. But no. Dreaming about bunnies. Well maybe she gets to eat the bunnies after she catches them. I don't know. I don't know if my dog's into that. One time she actually found like four bunnies. Um, babies. I don't know what baby bunnies are called. You know, they have like like pups for dogs and a whole bunch of other animals and um, like kids for goats. I don't know what a baby bunny is called, but whatever it is, my dog found a bunch of them under a bush. They had been abandoned by their mother, and because uh, they they don't make noise unless they're abandoned. They, and she she uh, heard them. Or I guess she smelled them first or something. I don't know, but um, she found them either way. And get it, get it, get it. You gotta get this one quick. Yes. Um. And she found them, and she actually was like very protective of them. She, I was, I thought she was gonna like try to eat them because up until then, all we knew is that she was like, like a total like dude of a female dog. She was like, she's like such a dyke. But um, no, she wasn't like tough. She got very motherly and protected them and stuff, and sat there like like grooming them, licking them. Maybe she was tasting them. I don't know. But uh, we we actually called the uh, the wild animal control or whatever, and they they said they try to rehabilitate them. I don't know if that's really true or if they like cooked them up, but whatever it was, out of our hands. Number fifty two. Doggy's still not waking up. I keep I'm like getting bolder and bolder with actually like speaking loudly as as it goes on, but she doesn't seem to notice. Okay, because we have we have so many dogs in the house right now. We have three dogs in the house. Yeah, that doesn't, probably doesn't seem like a lot to some people. Actually, my friend has, like, her family routinely keeps, like, six greyhounds because they adopt greyhounds from the racetracks. But, um, I'm a huge dog lover, by the way, if you can't tell. And, uh, I guess we're going back to Noki Bay. Still need to blue, do blue coins, but that'll be next episode. I just need to totally guess at what my time is on this episode. It's probably, it's probably going to be either really short or really long. Uh, I would guess the first, like, 25 minutes will probably boil down into more, like, 10 minutes, so I will record until 45 minutes. Okay, yeah. Not that you guys care. <laughs> Red coins in a bottle. Message in a bottle. Um, so yeah, we have, we have Bruno now, who's, who's our new dog. Um, and we're, we're babysitting my sister's dog as usual, Violet. Violet's fucking so dumb. I love her. So we have 
I'm not reading anything you're saying because it's retarded. Yeah, this is a fucking... These these levels are freaking annoying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, shut up. Here I go. So we've got a little pit bull. We've got a, uh, a mutt and a German Shepherd. And they're all just... Just chilling. Right now they're all sleeping. Bruno, Bruno and Violet, the pit bull and, and the mutt, they love each other. They absolutely love each other. Um, Chobi doesn't really like either of them too much. She seems to tolerate Bruno, and Violet has learned to avoid Chobi. But Chobi's a, Chobi's a grump. That's what she is. She She's a sweetie when it comes to us, like the family. But anybody else, including the other dogs, she is not the friendliest. Oh yeah, there's like a fucking current or something right there. Uh, okay, let's see if we can just get it to... Nope. You son of a bitch. You son of a bitch. These fucking fish, all they do is grab you and, like, fuck you up. They, like, drag you down. Just, you try to, like, drag me down, but you can't keep me down, man. This is so annoying. Oh my god, I hate this, because it doesn't seem to, like, make any sense. Alright, let's go. Oh, too far. God, this is dumb. I hate these gimmicky fucking levels. Got it. Okay. Next. For how much I say I hate the levels in this game, I'm surprised I even enjoy it at all. But I really do. It's more the levels I don't really comment about. I don't really say I, I really like this level, which I probably should. I should give this game its credit. I'll try to come up with, with some levels that I actually do really quite enjoy. Which is, to be fair, the majority of them. But there's actually two levels where you're doing this like underwater jetpack bullshit. And they both suck. But they're both in Noki Bay. And... What else sucks in Noki Bay? I'm not sure. Uh, finding the blue coin sucks in Noki Bay really bad. I do not enjoy that one bit. Um, there right, should be one more. I think it's just probably like up here somewhere. Um, fuck off, fish. Where's my last red coin at, yo? It's kind of hard to see because there's so many just like, fish polluting everything. How do you get this many fish in a little bottle? Fucking magic bottle and shit? Get away. Get away. Get away from me. Okay. Let's see if we can survey the landscape from up here. Um. Hmm. I don't know. Oh, there it is. Hiding. Hello. That wasn't too bad, right? It's kind of annoying. It was just that one with the, the like, current, the upwards current. How do you get a current in a fucking bottle? It's a magic bottle, man. Getting high as a motherfucker. 53! This probably isn't going to be my highest scoring episode. I'm seeing, like, how many stars I can get in an episode. The last episode we were doing pretty good. We were kind of banging them out up until the last one, which took, like, way too long. Um, but this one was... This one, we're not off to a good start. But I did bang out those last two pretty quickly. Or was it... Or was it the last one? Yeah, it was just... No, okay, because there was two, because there was a secret one. The secret one was just so easy. Okay, this is the other one with the uh, the underwater jetpack shit. This is the other one. So, yeah. Now, this asshole probably wants to tell me, like, a million things. I don't care. Grandpa's waiting. I don't care. Good. Okay. I think, yeah, this actually allows me to swim in the poison water. Oh, no, it doesn't. I completely lied to you. I apologize. I'll never do it again. That was also a lie, so... Yeah, think about it. Yeah, I'm sure your grandpa's waiting for me, but I could really give a fuck less what he wants. Because he's just going to tell me shit I already know. There we go. You just got to go into it. There's like a little... little thing. Actually, I guess there's three of these levels in here, I think. Maybe. No, I think it is just the two. Okay, so you see this? It's that shit down there. And this really freaked me out when I first started started this level. Because big things underwater really freak me out. I feel helpless in the water. Highly toxic materials approaching, yeah. My sensors. What the fuck is like a spray gun doing with sensors that detect toxic materials? Just what? This really freaked me out, because I, I thought the boss was in the hole, only to realize that the boss was in the hole. I freaked out. Okay, so he actually reaches up and tries to attack you, but... 
Or actually, it looks like it, but he's not. Yeah, he's actually just opening his mouth. You're, you're actually helping him out. Oh no! It is dark. I feel fright. Ah! It doesn't actually hurt you, I don't think. Yeah, he doesn't. The only thing is you need to kind of like jet over here and get some uh, get some coins because they provide air for some reason. I never really got the logic behind that one, but again, Mario logic, so who gives a fuck? Um, I don't know what the fuck he's doing right now. I don't know if this is supposed to be hard at all because like you're kind of cooperating with the boss. I don't know if you can even really consider him a boss. Okay, so I didn't quite get the other one. Did I? There you go. Oh, no, I did. Some of them fall out. Yeah, maybe don't eat me. I'm like the only person who can save you from your your own horrible oral hygiene. Let's grab some more coins. I'm getting low. What are you doing? Just spinning over there? I can't even be arsed to check up on what this asshole's doing. Let's go. Get them coins. I don't understand the like movement physics. You see, I was just kind of like now I'm like gliding along, but a second ago I was just moving like zero miles an hour. I don't know. It's weird. Okay, right now I don't think I want to go in there because he's he's trying to suck it all down. Who's got such bad dental hygiene that they're just they've got purple gunk on their shit? That's gross, man. You gross, nasty ass motherfucker. Here you go. Yeah. Yeah, drink it. No, 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 I'm not done. I'm not done. You stupid ass. I'm trying to help you. Look at you. You got fucking gingivitis and shit. You are disgusting. You're a disgusting eel. With two heads on one. Isn't that weird? He's got two sets of eyes on either side of his head. It's kind of fucked up. And he's got horrible dental hygiene. Just the worst. You're the worst. That and you freak me out because you're big and under the water. I have like a severe like fear of, even in video games, of being in the water with large things. Right now I'm okay because I've already dealt with this guy and I know he's not going to try to eat me. That's like one of my biggest like video game fears is putting putting me in the water with something large. And also whenever I'm like, whenever I'm in a body of water that I can't see like straight through, I also freak out because I, I imagine that there's something very large like right below me about to eat me and I'm helpless because it's water and humans aren't supposed to be in water but <laughs> um, I think that fear originated in Diddy Kong Kart or Diddy Kong Diddy Kong Racing was that what it was called? Diddy Kong Racing I think on the N64 and I don't know if it originated there like if, if this is what caused it but that was definitely when I realized it because you know in, in Diddy Kong Racing it wasn't just like a kart game it had a bunch of different vehicles and one of them was a hovercraft that you would pilot over like bodies of water and at some point like this giant fucking whale just swims beneath you and it freaked me out so bad as a kid I was just like no not cool I'm not okay with this fuck this noise it gave me chills and honestly it seems like a like a silly fear that like well why would you let something like that bother you but honestly I think it makes games more fun because games that aren't supposed to be scary like this one suddenly get like a little bit of a scary property and it kind of freaks me out I consider it fun I consider it a good a good fear also, I'll probably save my life if I ever go into the ocean and there's like a fucking shark because I'll just freak out and swim faster than any human has ever been known to swim. I don't know. Humans aren't supposed to be in water, that's all I'm going to say. I love swimming, but I have to be able to see what I'm swimming in. Know what I'm saying? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, got it. Okay. And it is pretty nice not having to get sucked up and deal with that stupid animation here. Hear that what's his dick is fucking frightened. Flood. Fuck you, Flood. Fuck you. Do, do. Actually, you know what? This this boss music really reminds me of the uh, the boss music in Mario and Luigi. It actually might be. It actually might be like like some variation of it. I'm not sure which game came out first, but I do know. I don't know. GameCube and GBA were like were like the same generation. I mean, slightly. You know, they didn't come out like the same time or anything, but so they're like slightly off of each other. But still, they were like the same uh, generation. Kind of like the DS and the Wii. Now there's a 3DS and the and the Wii U. But I'm not sure which game came first. 
This is taking me way too long. Finally. I think a bunch of his teeth, like, fell out. Yeah, there you go. Don't be so fucking disgusting next time. Bye. Brush your teeth. Brush your teeth, brush your teeth, brush your goddamn teeth. Where do Yoda in? N word. Almost said it. Almost said the N word, and everybody would think I'm a racist. I'm not a racist. I'm white. Wait, what? Go ahead, Mario. Go get, get the star. I can't, like, can't make him descend any faster. Ooh, does that make me? No, it just looks like I was dropping faster. And money. Number 54. Still asleep, dog? Yeah, she's still asleep. She's fine. Say it, I continue. Drinking some orange Gatorade this time? <clears throat> Delicious. Except it, like, got caught in my windpipe because I can't drink because I'm retarded. I don't know how to drink liquids. Alright, we got time for one more star, I think. And then, I think I'm going to do blue coins. Maybe I'll do it in the next recording session, like at the beginning, but... Oh, I never want to do that. Il Piantissimo Surf Swim. Fuck you, Il Piantissimo. I hate you. I hate you for real. Look at this fucking cocky asshole. Oh my god, I'm gonna poop on your mouth. Okay. Like, on it. I mean, I obviously am not... Your mouth isn't gonna be open, so I'm just gonna poop on your lips. Alright. Sup, asshole. <laughs> Ho ho, foolish man. I am Il Piantissimo, I know. Yes, that is me. And now, I challenge you to a race to the flag. Race to the finish. So I know, like, some of this has to do with, like, swimming, if you want. But I think it's faster to go on the platforms. I don't know. It is a race to the finish. The best time is 40 seconds. Are you at the ready? Then get set and go. I can't decide if this guy's, like, Spanish or... Like, my accent that I'm doing. I can't decide if it's Spanish or fucking... Uh, French, but I'm pretty sure either way it's supposed to be Italian. <laughs> because, like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what makes me think that. Just because it's a Mario game? What am I, racist? Could have had a better time, but I could not give less of a shit as long as I beat this asshole. Man, that was real hard, bro. You're really good at this. Oh, wait, no, you're not. Look at you. Yep. Any second now. Wow, I can actually feel myself getting older. Jesus Christ, you suck. Yep, I know, yep. Woo ha, wheeze, you are quite. quite? You are quite speedy. You are like a fish. You may not be the slow clam chomper I took you for. Clam chomper? I chomp all the clams, buddy. May we race again? Watch for me. I really hope we don't, actually. I really hope I never see you again in my life because you make me feel physically ill. <laughs> okay. Number 55, and I actually think since this was an Il Piantissimo uh, level episode, then um, we have time for one more, I think. I think. Probably going to end up going way over the time I, I like set for myself. I don't know. I'm trying to like gauge how long. It, it actually took me 25 minutes to do the 100 coin star, but since so much of that is going to be sped up with like me doing the watermelons and stuff, I'm trying to figure out like how long that would actually take. Okay, so here's a secret level. Ugh. God, it had to be a secret level. <laughs> oh man, we haven't done a secret level in a little while now. Not a hard one anyway, we've done a couple. I think we did one last episode, I lied. But, we haven't done a hard one. Like in forever. And I think, I can't remember if this one's hard or not. I, th I get the feeling that this one gave me some trouble. But I can't say for sure. Um... Oh, whoops. That was my bad. Okay, I feel dumb. No problem, though. I actually think the um, the secret levels, even though like I get stuck on them a lot, I think they're probably one of my favorite parts of this game. Because it's fun. It's fun. Like It is kind of annoying because like, it takes the the, uh, the pack away. It takes Flood away. And um, you're not used to not having Flood. So it makes it harder when, like, if this was like Mario 64, those levels wouldn't be that hard because you'd be used to maneuvering without flood. But uh, I still think they're really fun. I think it's right above me. I think. Um, let's find out. Tight rope. Let's see which one's it on. Ah, here it is. There we go. Quite a few shells, actually. Can he grab it? 
Yes, he can. And then he's gonna get hit by that thing. Okay. All right, we good. We good. We solid. Okay. Get the fuck out of here, Shadow Mario. Okay. Do ba. Um. Yeah, I think this one's pretty tough, actually. Is this what I gotta do? Yeah. Okay. Let's see if we can find some some one ups, bitch. I want damn green mushrooms. You need to get high as a motherfucker. Shrooms. One up shrooms. Stop my. Dude, this has gotta hurt so bad, what Mario's doing right now. Just slamming on a sheet of metal. Makes me think in TF2. <clears throat> I've been playing a lot of TF2 again. If you, if you haven't been keeping up with the rest of my channel, like if this, is, if this is the only thing of mine that you watch, I've been playing a lot. Oh my god, I can't fucking hit this. I've been playing a lot of TF2 recently. And, um. There's a taunt the soldier has where he, like. He screams and like bashes his head with his shovel, and normally it's not that bad because the shovel is like a flat surface and he wears a helmet, so it's not that bad. Um, and the reason he does that, if if you haven't played DF2, is because the soldier's just insane <laughs> and funny. He's not insane like oh, totally awesome manly man insane. Like he is kind of like that, but he's also just like hilariously insane. The the game is more funny than serious, but. But anyway, um, they just released a new, a new melee weapon. That, well, they actually nerfed an old melee weapon and by splitting its effects into two melee weapons. That's pretty confusing to us. There we go. Okay, now I'm sure that none of the other ones are actually one-ups. Might be like one other. But, oh, okay, he didn't slide. Okay. This is gonna. I'm gonna go way over the time. Yeah, I'm already over the time that I was aiming for. But anyway, so so they introduced basically a new melee weapon. Um, that is a pickaxe. And shares the same the same taunt animation with with the shovel. So now he's bashing himself in the head with a pickaxe. And I have a hat that replaces his his helmet. So it's a, and it's actually not even a hat; it's just hair. So he doesn't have anything protecting his head, and he's just bashing his his unarmored head with a pickaxe. And it is hilarious. I fucking love that shit. Okay, I guess it's this one. Should remember, it's the one on the right on the first red platform we get to. Okay. But yeah, it makes me laugh. Nope. Alright, now I'm like paranoid that he's not gonna grab on. Oh. oh yeah! Didn't think I was gonna make that one. Alright. Let's go here. One of these has like a really weird, like I'm not really sure which way I'm supposed to go. What the fuck? I thought he was gonna do it. What? Why, Mario? Why you not grab on to pole? Why you, why you do this to me? Oh, you're a fucking asshole, Mario. Oh, I'm sorry, Chovy. I just woke up my dog. I don't know why. That wasn't particularly louder than anything else I've said today. You're retarded, Chovy. I love you, though. You're my dog. Okay. Okay. I don't know why I'm acting like, like I gotta suck myself up for this one. I haven't fucked up on this part yet. Let's get this free life. I almost wish that they, they didn't have a life system, because it just feels like a waste of time. Like, I, did, I don't understand it. I don't understand why games still need lives. Like, you can say it's adding to the challenge, but it's really not. It's just making it take longer. I, I don't get it. I don't know. Okay. So, here we go. I guess we gotta go up here. Oh, I see it. I see it. We're good. So, I'm sorry, Joby. Go back to sleep. I don't know if, if it's, like, the actual sound that she's hearing or if it's, like, the, vib the vibration of my voice, but she's, she's picking up on something. Can I? Nope, can't make that. Um, I'm not really sure what it wants me to do here, but let's try this one. Nope. Okay, I fucked up the jump. Stop spinning, Mario fucking killing me here, bro. Okay. Where am I going? Over there. Need to get up there. Okay, maybe if I just do this really close. Oh, it was really close. Got it. Oh, baby. I really don't know how I'm actually supposed to do that, but one of these pins is probably also a one-up, but I really don't feel like getting it. Fuck that noise. Alright, these are starting to spin faster. Oh god, oh god, oh god. I got caught in the little thing. Okay. 
I think this is... This part's not that bad. You just gotta keep it... Oh, okay. <laughs> I did not mean to spin jump. I meant to do a flip jump. Would have much preferred a flip jump there. Oh, yeah. Gotta do a Peggy Hill. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Shit my pants. Got it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Number 56, baby. Okay, I think this is gonna be it for this one. I went way over time. I'm just gonna really hope that that first star is quick after all the fast forwarding. Or maybe I'll just fast forward the whole one. I'm not sure. The whole, the whole thing. But... I don't know, we'll see. Anyway guys, thanks for watching. Oh god, she farted. Oh, my dog just farted so bad. It smells so bad. Please like the video if you liked it. It'll make me feel so much better. Oh my god, that smells horrible. <laughs> okay, bye internet. See you next time. Oh. <laughs>